I'm sitting on the floor. Get my sand back on. dudes it's laddie here and um, as you can see I am outside I am indeed outside um, yeah so it's sunny it's Britain and it's sunny and I am very surprised it's su surprised and there's a big spider on my on my deck chair because honestly I haven't used a deck chair in a very long time, probably since I was a child, probably when I had less trauma in my life. <sighs> okay, well it's sunny and I am outside and even though it's sunny it is, you know, very cold and windy. Uh, um, but, but, and, 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 I, and I have my, my upper calf and lower thigh showing as, you know, the tutorial for the lift and pull would have shown. Um, and I am, I'm just about freezing, but, um, but it is sunny and Brits do not turn down the chance of a sunny day. So today, today Laddie is outside and my neighbour's door is open and he's pretty much listening to my entire conversation with my camera. Um, so let's wrap this up so that, that my explanation to my neighbours as to why I'm sitting dressed like this with socks and sandals outside on my deck is short and brisk as well. Um, okay, so today, today is Mother's Day. And um, so I, I came, I thought, you know what, since I'm outside and everyone, all of my neighbours can hear me and it's very windy for you probably, you probably can't hear whatever I'm saying. Um, so that I can explain what is best to do on holidays such as these. So today, Mother's Day is a day when you probably, unless you're unfortunate and I, I don't know, some weird accident, horrific accident caused all of your mothers to die, all of the mothers in your family, all of the women with children in your family to die, um, then it will be a day when you crowd around a table with all of your family members and you give love to your mothers. And I only just, um, I only just gave my mum her present, which was a, a picture of her favourite child, um, my cat Lucy. Put it up on screen here. I um, don't know why I drew it, but um, but I did. I thought, you know what? Who? What? What does my mum love more than me? My cat. What to do on holidays such as these? There's Christmas. There's um, like I guess there's July the thingieth in America. July the fourth something like that in America and then there's you know there's Easter or whatever other religious thing goes on where you have to gather with your family that are probably disappointed with you and this is for people like me or like other people that their parents are disappointed in them because of a choice that's out of their hand um, so for example in my example I'm going to use transgender and I'll probably do another video with like homophobic family so the first thing you should do if you can from holidays like this um, where you have to gather around your family is run. Okay, now with with rational thought, probably shouldn't run. It's probably not a good idea. Um, but um, try and find any other plan. You could think about sorting it out with your family, but some families just don't want to sort it out with, you know. So um, just uh, if you can't run, if you can't pack your things. Then, um, then find something to do, be like, oh shit, my Canadian friend's um, foreign grandmother like fell over and fractured a hip and the, my friend, my, Cana my, my Canadian friend is like crying and what can I do about it? Like I've got to go help them. I wish I could stay here. All, all week for Mother's Day, but 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 think of my foreign gra my foreign friend's grandmother's hip, you know. Or there's 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 also yeah, just think of cool plans like oh shit, like revision. They'll always get you out of that. They'll be like oh you don't need to do that, child. 
you down. It, it'll be a point where if you can't make a plan to get out of it, what to do when you're at the dinner with all of your family that are probably disappointed in you. So, I suggest when you sit down at the table, don't talk to anybody. But if you have to talk to people, um, and if, for example, in my situation, half of my family call, some of my family call me to uh, Toby, um, some of my family call me Tia, which is my original name, um, and like it's gonna be like a bit orcs if one of them are, some of them aren't, and then some of them try to, even some of them that aren't will maybe start just calling you, you know, Tia anyway, because everyone else is, and then and then it's all it's all a bit it's all a bit awkward if they start calling your original name. But if you're with family that's especially disappointed with you, then I'd say I always bring it up because I'm a confronting bastard. But don't just don't bring it up. Every time I bring it up, it ends in some sort of form of like row or something. But um, my family isn't too bad with it. Like my mum and everything isn't too bad with it. But um, not amazing, but not too bad like compared to other families so if your family is one of those families that is like um not not to stereotype but yes to stereotype um so for example like certain religions like not not all people in religion are against the lgbt stuff but certain religions a lot of people in them will be against it and you know so if, if your mum's like jesus still loves you mm -hmm. jesus Jesus still loves you. He he holds you here, and even though you've been taken over by the gay spirit, and you've been possessed by the gay spirit, Jesus will forgive you. Just remember, kids, Jesus still loves you. At that point, I just say nod and wave. Just smile and wave until you get to fuck off out of your family life and, and leave them and go to a completely different city or state or whatever. I mean, obviously, before all of this, you should if you've come out to them, if this is why it's it's awkward and everything, then um, then you should try speak to them first about it. But obviously that can't happen for everybody. I mean, either that or kill your family. I mean, don't do that. Don't, that's a bad idea. That's, that's not a good idea, don't do that. Um, because you will be arrested. We don't want, anyway, continuing on. Um, there's nothing much you can do about family that are disappointed in LGBT people or don't like it or think that they're doing something wrong. There's nothing really much. It's awkward. Like, I've gotten to not enjoy family situations necessarily because being around, like, you have to go over to your grandparents or something like that and, and being around the family sitch, the family sitch is a bit, bit awkward sometimes. So, um, the least I can say to do is you know respect your parents respect that they do um, they, you know they do really care for you and you know there's nothing much you can really do about it just kill them and run <laughs>enjoyed this random video um, I don't even know what it was and I do not condone any murdering of families or homicides that um, occur as a result of this video um, <laughs> uh, it is it's just a bit of fun really but in all serious some summary of this video I know it's awkward going to festive family gatherings like Mother's Days and Christmases and Easter's and other things where you have to go meet like older family and other family that don't really understand you as an LGBTQ plus person but I don't it there's so many different family scenarios but I'm just trying to in this video get the gist of if your family is um, if your family isn't exactly like the most supportive of you and your like LGBT stuff, then 
I'd suggest like and you've tried to change their mind I definitely suggest just try not to bring it up and if they bring it up um, just try to like change the subject if they try and bring it up in a bad way because there's not much you can do it is quite awkward and I guess you just have to develop a sort of thick skin when they're calling you you know the names that when they're like calling you the names that they want to call you like your original name if you're trans or if they're being kind of like they're asking you if you're gay or something like oh uh, have you got a girlfriend yet or have you got a boyfriend yet you know or whatever like they, they always seem to ask um, and, it, and I know it may make people feel uncomfortable but honestly like sometimes you've got to understand that they're not going to understand especially older family luckily all of my older family seem to understand and I was so surprised at that but you know I hope I hope if anything whatever family festive stuff goes well just try and have fun with your family without mentioning it and then if you really don't like your family because of their views on stuff like that then just grit your teeth and smile until it and hold it out and get support with friends and other things until you can finally leave home because be able to like actually get out of um, the house um, and be able to live on your own and not be confined within your family's views and everything like that but anyway I hope Mother's Day goes well to you happy Mother's Day to my mum none of this video was an offence to her really um, but you know she's not as bad compared to other parents believe me like she tries to call me Toby and stuff um, but thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed this little summary as well as well as my weird sketch down there um, <laughs> and and just just thank you for watching my videos um subscribe on my facial region there'll be other videos down here thank you so much for watching and oh my god it's like up to like it was like 400 oh my god it's gone up to like 400 to 450 subscribers now and it's crazy the amount of people that are watching and all my commenters and thank you guys so much like all the people commenting even the people with criticism i do still appreciate criticism because it just it's all of the opinions that i like to be able to have both sides because i'm not really i try to be very in between in my views and i just love everyone's opinions everyone's comments all the likes and everything and thank you so much anyway thank you guys all for subscribing subscribe on my face if you liked this if you didn't then okay okay subscribe um videos yeah awkward <laughs> like family dinners <laughs> enjoy <laughs>